Hello friends, it's me. And today is Darman Monday and we're gonna be watching a video about a teacher who gets revenge on his student. Wait, they can do that? Yo, check this out. What the heck? Who did this? Oh no, somebody hacked my computer. What's wrong? Someone just hacked into my code and locked me out. Let's see. Didn't lock you out, idiot. Looks okay. All right, for this week's assignment, we are going to be building on the code in order to finalize the app for the school. Oh, this is gonna be a piece of cake. Do you have something to share with the class, Kyle? No. Nope. All right, so the assignment is worth 20% of your grade and it is due by two o'clock on Friday. We're gonna be using Python and- um, Shouldn't we be using JavaScript? All right, listen here, smart guy. Why don't you get up here and start teaching the class? Well, we've been using Python the whole year, so we're gonna stick with that. Yeah, but all the big Companies use Java, Facebook, Netflix, Uber. Should I keep going? True, but just because they're using a certain programming language doesn't make it better. In fact- In fact, I feel like you should be teaching us real world applicable skills so we can work at these companies. I mean, isn't that the whole point of all of this? Ah, uh, yeah, you can get up here and start doing my job since you know everything, huh? I remember when back when I was in school, my math teacher was like, you gotta learn how to do all this math. It's not like you're gonna go through life with a calculator in your back pocket. Oh look, guess who was wrong? A lot of companies use Python, Kyle. Yeah, um, I'm starting to think that you don't even know Java. Ooh. And why do you say that? Well, uh, because if you did, I don't see why you would give up a real salary job at a big tech company and, and settle for being a teacher. Ooh! <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, he kind of destroyed her right there. Maybe I want to teach little idiots like you to code. I feel like I could teach this class. I teach because I enjoy working with students. Not everyone has to work at Google in order to be considered successful. Yeah, and I feel like your paycheck disagrees. Oh, he just keep um, going. I would have sent him to the principal. <laughs> That's it. Principal's office now. The disrespect on this fella. Oh, Mr. Harrington. Glad you could join us. We're about to begin. Is he gonna fight yeah, with this teacher what too? Happened? I was in detention. I don't know what the whole big deal is. I was just spitting facts. It's not my fault I'm smarter than these teachers. <laughs> we got students that think they're smarter than teachers now? Nah, this is a new breed. For today's class, we're going to learn about decomposition reactions by conducting the age-old experiment using acid and carbonate. In front of you, you each have three beakers. One filled with water, one filled with vinegar, and another filled with baking soda. I already know how to do it. I saw this on TikTok. We'll take the one that's filled with water. What is this, the 80s? <laughs> <laughs> do you have something to say back there, Mr. Harrington? Yeah. I mean, what is this, sixth grade? The volcano experiment? We're in high school now. Shouldn't we elevate our experiments? Maybe blow something up? These are in the approved curriculum. This wake up and choose violence, get out of bed, do a little stretch, go to class, be like, <sighs> I think I'm gonna start a problem with every single teacher today. Calm down. You in a high school class with the rest of these chooms. Yeah, but all great scientists took risks. They experimented to prove their hypothesis and their theories. Why can't we do that? Because you're not an actual scientist. This isn't even an AP class. When you're a science teacher, you can do that. But until then, we'll do the approved experiments. Like, the teacher can't just come into the science class and be like, well, let's blow stuff up. There's like risks, health hazards, like approved material you can and can't do. Bro, really watch the TikTok video. Some dude in a lab coat blowing things up. We take the one filled with water and we mix it with the baking soda. Oh, what the? <laughs> Yo, Mr. Ward, I don't know if it's supposed to do that. Yes, I'm aware of that, Kyle, thank you. Yeah, I feel like you don't because you just mix the wrong chemicals. My teachers would have literally been like, shut up. Literally shut your mouth or you can leave. I would not be able to handle that level of disrespect from a child. You just have the same old curriculum year after year. How, how do you mess this up? You know, Kyle, <laughs> you should never judge someone until you walk a mile in their shoes. Oh! Is that the Darman message that we're learning today? Can't judge someone unless you walk a mile in their shoes. So if you ever want to say anything about strippers, make sure you put on some nine inch heels, walk to the gas station and back, and then you could talk. I wouldn't mind except your shoes suck. <laughs> oh! 
Hey, you're wearing Converse. And you never disrespect the Converse gang like that again. I can't believe Mr. Ward gave me Thank another you. detention. I was just trying to make the class more interesting. Maybe you should just let the teachers do their job. That's what they're there for. The I would the if they actually knew what they were doing. Look, you don't need a PhD or a master's to be a high school teacher. Just glorify babysitters. Uh, I mean, <laughs> he do got a point about that. It can't be that hard. Go teach a class Kyle. then. What do we have here? This doesn't look like chocolate chip cookie dough. Well, cookies are for amateurs and I wanted to make something more my level. Are they though? Do you have any idea how hard it is to find a decent chocolate chip cookie? Unless you're making macaroons, please sit down and shut up. You really gonna roast the home ec teacher now? I went to Italy last summer and I had tiramisu. Tiramisu? So I to recreate that. It's not hard to make tiramisu. Well, as impressive as that is, it's not the assignment. I'm grading you on cookies, not tiramisu. You're gonna fail me because I baked something more difficult than the original recipe? No, I'm failing you because you literally did not understand the assignment, idiot. Grades are based on following instructions. Maybe you should follow my instructions. <laughs> that way we could actually learn something new. Oh, she want to turn around and smack the spatula right off his hand. I don't know. We all know that we take home egg for an easy A. Maybe raise the bar a little bit. I know I did. I don't appreciate your tone, young man. One more word out of you and your- Detention. Yeah, used to it. This is my third one today, actually. Bro is becoming immune to detentions. These kids are killing me. Bad day? Don't even get me started. All the teachers who got roasted are gonna sit and cry about it at lunch. <laughs> oh, how the tables have turned. You have no idea how ready I am for winter break. I hear that. I have this one student. He thinks he's smarter than everyone else including me. I've got a couple of those, but one in particular really takes the cake. Always talking back, undermining everything I say. Wait, are you talking about who I think you're talking about? Kyle, Kyle Harrington. Harrington. Oh, you know you a problem when they name drop you in the teacher's lounge. Oh, let's see what kind of revenge they gonna get on this guy. He has no idea how hard it is being a teacher. <laughs> if only there was a way to teach that. Wait a second. Walk Maybe a mile we can. in their shoes. Let him teach Maybe the class. We can. What? Teach Kyle Harrington a lesson. I really hope y'all are gonna like group up and jump him after school. <laughs> uh, Ms. Crawford, what are you doing? That's my seat. Not it's today. It's Jennifer, actually, but you can call me Jen. What are you doing? Well, I thought about what you said yesterday, and since you're so good at coding, Get up and teach I class. thought I would take some time off, and you could teach the class for the rest of the week. Wait. Mr. Ward and Mrs. Gallo have been so impressed with your work this year that they want you to take over their classes as well. And this isn't a trap. Not at all. We just figured you're so advanced that this would be a great learning experience for you. So I'd be running the class, and we could use JavaScript for the app? Bro, are you stupid or something? She literally said, get up and teach the class, idiot. Sure, it's up to you. It's your class. Do what you want. Unless you're not up I'm for leaving. teaching, Bye. then no, we can. No, no, I'll do it. All right, everybody, have a seat. Welcome, class. Greetings. Is he teaching? Is he doing a good job? He's actually doing it. How does he know what to do? I would get up there and be like, uh, are you gonna make the whole med class and make tiramisu? If you're smarter than everybody, what are you still doing here? You would have graduated years ago. You would have been going to Yale right now. For science class, we're gonna do a volcano experiment, but not the dumb baking soda and vinegar kind. Oh, and for home ec, I got a recipe online for macarons. You cannot make macaroons at school. Do you know how long it takes to make macaroons? You cannot do in a class. Did you cure the egg whites for 48 hours? No, I don't think so. Okay, today class, we'll be doing the volcano experiment. Whose is that? Oh, it's me. I have to take this. As I was saying before, I got so rudely interrupted. <laughs> We're gonna be taking the volcano experiment up a notch. In the middle of this, we have some pieces of potassium. Now I'll take water from this bottle, pour it in here, and we'll get a chemical reaction that will result in smoke. Won't that produce hydrogen? Yeah, exactly. You can't do that. It'll start a fire or worse. I'm the teacher here. If I want to burn the whole school down, I will. Shush. Who's the teacher here? You or me? Shush. You? Exactly. I know what I'm talking about, okay? 
Who here has a higher grade than me? <laughs> Everybody raises their hand. Now that we've established <laughs> that I'm the smartest one here, let's proceed on with the experiment. The people who think they're the smartest Water, usually aren't. Get down! It's gonna blow! No, he, he thinks this is... We're not... This is not a game. Oh, no. What, what happened? happened? I, uh, I may have underestimated the power of a volcanic eruption. And this is exactly why we don't do this little TikTok experiment at school. You sure you're all right? I'm fine. Uh, today we'll be making some macarons. I printed the recipes online, so everybody should be able to follow it. Now, before we get started, is there any questions? Yeah, the bake setting on the oven is broken. I can only use the broiler. Do you think that'll work? Yeah. No. I don't see why not. No. Uh, actually, Kyle. You Kyle? No, it's Mr. Harrington to you. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I need to recognize the teacher. No. She and her That's peasant clothes. Um, Mr. Harrington. Yes, Jen. We you might sure have a can't problem. broil some macaroons. The code for the app? It isn't working. Well, what are you talking about? I wrote it myself. I don't know. Come take a look. What the, the? The code's not working. I told you something was wrong with it. How is this possible? The last I checked, the code was solid. I don't know. You're the teacher. Maybe we should have used whatever Python. it is, you better hurry yeah. because uh, the final version is due in five minutes. Okay, if I just... Uh, if for you minute. guys, I'm the teacher. I don't have to do the work. <laughs> oh my gosh, nothing's working. Four minutes. Dude, hurry up. It's 20% of our grade. I don't rush me, okay? I got this. Are you guys doing code on a, on a Mac? I don't know nothing about coding. Mr. Harrington? What now? We kind of have an emergency. Can't you see I'm already in one? Okay, it, what is so Something important that you need to interrupt? Macaroons. The whole classroom is on fire. What? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Put out the fire. Why don't hey, you just chill hey, there? Guys, like, back uh, up, back the up. room's on fire. Oh, she didn't, like, you know, this is why we what have did you smoke do? detectors. Because somebody vaped in the bathroom, the smoke alarm gonna go off. But the whole entire whole mech room on fire? The smoke alarm, like, I didn't smell nothing. Oh. Oh. Yeah, and that's an evacuation. Excuse me, excuse me. Where the heck have you been? You're gonna you make us all fail. Shush, okay, just let me focus. This is impossible. One minute. Mmm, you're gonna ruin this for everyone. Oh no, everything is falling apart for Kyle. Just help. I'm sorry. What was that? I don't know what I did wrong. I don't know how to fix it. Can, can you help us, please? <laughs> oh, it was so simple. How? Rule number one in coding, never let your guard down. Because as soon as you do, you're gonna be hacked. You hacked me? I tried to tell you. JavaScript is great, but it is more vulnerable to malicious activity. Hence why we use Python. Turns out teaching isn't as easy as it looks, huh? Yeah, it's not exactly what I expected. Teaching is not easy, because they gotta deal with people like you, times a hundred. I know you're smart, and you think you have all the answers, but you should never judge someone until you walk them I know, on. I know, walk them all in their shoes. You're just a wee little high school student who bit off more than he could chew. You know, that should be the moral of the story. Don't bite off more than you can chew. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I... My feet are tired. Can I just go back to being a student? I think for everyone's safety, that would be best. A reward for a hard-earned lesson. A store-bought Costco macaroon! That's terrible. I know. <laughs> yeah, you made it, idiot. I like that one, that was actually really funny. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button in the face. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click. And I just released some new merch. We got hoodies, shirts, tank tops at ogwolfpack.com. I'll link it below. And subscribe to the Wolfpack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching, bye guys.